Hello everybody and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. In the last episode we um, we banished off almost at Bark Scene. Large scene down in the 12th floor uh, exit and we also defeated um, this replica of Riku and start to go watch the last episode if you haven't already. Um, but now we are uh, by the entrance of the 13th for 13th floor, which is where Marilucia should be in. I'm not sure if this is the uh, final battle right behind this door. Not likely, but let's go to the 13th and final floor. Who was it? Who's most important to me? Nothing. Can't you remember? No, I only remember Naminé. Come on, do you guys remember anything at all? <sighs> no, sorry, Shola. It's important. But I just can't remember. I don't want to be. But I'm getting scared. Then we should really make a promise. Huh? What you said back there kind of got my brain uh, thinking. Whenever you make a promise that's super duper big, maybe it gives you the courage to face the scary stuff. Courage. Let's do it! Even if we get scared, or in trouble, or even if we get separated. Or even if we sort of forget each other. Whatever happens, we're friends. I'm a red and red for all! Okay, so there we learn a Trinity Limit, which is a pretty, pretty nice, uh, um limits so i guess it's a little bit better than that goofy uh, wild crush you see what i did there okay then so uh since we got the key of beginnings as well it seems a little like this world i guess will work like other other worlds So this is Castle Oblivion. So as usual, I'm going to have a quick little look at the world map. The enemies here looked pretty strong. I just want to say that I have done some off-screen leveling. Um, so this is where we're headed. Well, wow, this was quite the quite the place. I'm going to use a lot of my cards here. But yeah, I have done some off-screen leveling as usual because I thought I was a little bit under-leveled for the final approach of the game. And these things are car breaking me already. This is not a good start. Start. I've also crammed uh, this move Judgment into my deck, which actually proves to be quite powerful. Seems like I will get some nice experience out of these fights though. Win. Also when I've used Tornado, all um, flying enemies come quite weak against... Uh, or become possible to hit with Quake. Take this. Yeah, that was quite the um, light show. Um, thank you. Ragnarok. I. Yeah, why not? Why not? 
displays are nice as well. Okay, so that won't be uh, yet up used, will not end up being used that well because that was pretty weak card, so yeah, a little waste. And I missed a random card, I didn't see what it was. Hopefully Goofy can f take out some of the airborne enemies, and he actually did. I'm guessing the criteria there are... Okay, I thought they were going to be way worse. I'm getting a lot of experience here, at least. I'm soon down to an another level. Works for me. <laughs> Now where to? Okay, so there's only one exit and that is obviously this one, so... I guess we're up. And what are these bells? They give us at least some nice things. Gotta feel like they call upon Heartless too. Did I call upon a Heartless? Or this is quite a challenging floor, I'll admit that. They are the enemies here are pretty harsh. Harsh, harsh, harsh. I do, as I said earlier, get a lot of experience though, so <laughs> I shouldn't really complain. But at last battle I just couldn't finish up that one enemy because my cards are a little too weak, it appears. So my levels doesn't really seem to be a problem, but it's actually my way of building up my card deck. So I wouldn't really say I'm prepared for the final approaches of the game right now. <laughs> I'm actually pretty scared. without wishing stars card popping up everywhere. I need to find the next room. I'm getting really dead tired of this room right now. Oh, I think I saw it down here. Oh, love. A mobile room may do as well.
Oh no, that didn't look really promising at all. But again, if that's Axel, that may that may be good. So let's just cross all fingers that it was not um, that Marluxia fellow. Just give me some good cards, this is the final world. Yeah, thank you, completely useless. <laughs> Okay, so that's that's pretty nice. And a final magic stock. Completely useless. Oh well. <laughs> it's all gambling. That Trinity Limit thing though, that's a pretty strong attack. Okay, so I didn't really get to show it off, but I'll show it off as soon as I make one. But at least I did level up, and I am boosting my CP as just as much as possible right now, because I need room for stronger cards. And there's a lot of wishing stars in Castle Bluvin, at least. Not really sure what to make of that, but it's something. <laughs> Donald plus Goofy plus 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 an attack card is the end. Really. Just let's hope that I'll hit all those things. Uh, quite a light show. And I don't remember that I showed you early in the episode, but <laughs> okay. <laughs> And there's a lot of gene in this world as well. <laughs> Maybe Genie is the true leader of Castle Oblivion. Who knows? I need a save room right now. <laughs> oh, I'm getting. I'm really. T I'm really scared that I, if I lose about now, I'll have to load the game all the way back to Castle Oblivion. That f just the thought freaks me out.
So, where are we right now? Um, because there's two possible exits here. I should make it up here because um, there is a. I believe I can use my treasure car here or something. So if that, that's the blue exit. Because I have like those treasure cards. There should be a pretty grand prize in this world. Or at least, yeah, there should be one. And that door is right there. How convenient. Convenient, yes, convenient. 30. <laughs> Red cards, I should have enough of strong red cards. <laughs> or not. The price there better be good. <laughs> I should have just used my black rooms. <laughs> and let's just catch in that random joker. Because I don't have green cards at all. Because they never appear. <laughs> now then, this world better have a nice treasure for us. That's like a treasure chest in the world that never was. Okay, so that is... Yeah, that's a good ability, considering that I can actually use it in battle too. So, now I can speed up my gliding. Yeah. But yeah, I really think that is it for this... Um, <laughs> this almost at this week's episode, all, although that's pretty much true. Uh, this episode of Kingdom Hearts Reach Shadow Memories. Um, in the next episode, we will at least try to work our way up here. Uh, I think since... Uh, it appeared that some scenes will appear like at random during the way. I will just keep progressing on to these worlds because there isn't really much to show. There's just empty room with a lot of enemies. So I'll just show you the scenes as I go on and skip all the battles. So it will be somewhat more entertaining for you to watch. But uh, uh, I'll take it in the next episode. In the next episode I will see you back in um, the Moments Reprieve room. So until then, everybody, goodbye, bye, go, go. See you in the next video.